it's not. I think what you're saying is it's not accepted. The, the Vietna, the, the chain of time, is not accepted as a valid historical method. It's not. It's not accepted. It's like by a historian. That's not how history works. No. I feel like in terms of the story comes along and says, well, what actually happened? Mm. And he said, well, he said and she said and son of thing said and grandson of thing said. Yeah. It's, 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 it's kind of going, hey, that's, they're saying that that's, that's the worst way to, to keep information. I've yes. had that debate multiple times. Yes. Uh, it's obviously, you know, um, don't worry, you, we, we're, we're, all, we're old geezers. So remember the TV series Roots? Yes. Yeah. And, and the late Alex Haley, he plagiarised a lot of it, especially the crossing from West Africa to uh, America. He had to pay damages to some white guy who'd written a, a story which was very much the same. But put that to one side, the series Roots took off massively. And it's alleged, and, and you start with Haley, who's, um, you know, he becomes an adult in the 1940s, and he's allegedly received the, the accounts of his ancestors in North America and then back to, to this character Kunta Kinte in West Africa. And, they, and he's saying, look, this is to be trusted. It's a real oral tradition handed on from um, the tribe that Kunta Kinte was from. Because that tribe, like many in West Africa, had an oral tradition where you handed things on. Authentically, from generation to generation, for centuries. And so we can trust the accounts that Alex Haley had through his family. But put aside the fact that he made it up because he plagiarised the account of the passage across the Atlantic of Kunta Kinte himself. People went to West Africa. Socio-anthropologists went to West Africa and they looked into the oral culture of West Africans. And they, it showed the oral tradition is extremely plastic, very flexible. It changes with the time as you need it. Yeah. Yes. That's it. But it, it, you know what? It doesn't detract from its function. It's an extremely valuable binding force for a culture and for a society. No doubt about it. But it was never intended to fulfil the function of being an historical means of trans uh, sorry, a means of transmitting historical truths. 